where's kind of comp? I suppose. I right? mean, for all we know, this could be a instantly joy first pick for the side of Chibi here. Again, it, it's wide out of the open. They could be flexible, but Chips! Finally, all right. We get to talk about it. Chip has finally been unlocked for a professional play. Oh, Zarn looks happy. I mean, he's going to be the IGL. And this is an important role on top of playing Chip because his portals can be a double-edged sword. Much as he can, a good way to actually exploit Chip for the time being. He can easily head off to the top side, but it really doesn't matter at this point, right? Yeah, right now. Beautiful, beautiful early game coming in from the homeboys. Instantly finished Zeno this oh. time around underneath the start. He's level two and Chibi is level four. The minions have pushed in. Retribution being committed as well. Instantly taking him out. Looking for a trade though. Subway comes rolling on in, but Udo says no. He can use to gain more EXP than him. But Zorn continuing to be oh. forces the portal instantly. Punishing Nova X Cobra. He was not ready for that time. You see Subway rolling off. And right now, Chibi finds no bikes. Oh, and Zorn, he immediately goes through. Why walk? Good timing. Positioning to make sure that Monster Beaches cannot go forward. So for them to go forward, they got to kill someone first. Well, speaking of killing, they're going to get right on top of Ruff. And even before the Zaman Force gets dropped down. And Zorn here, he's not roaming around the map. Yeah, he's keeping eyes. He's going to take the portal down to the bottom side. Zeno's pushed up pretty far here. And Sopat is going to take full advantage. The knockoff is good. But does it matter when you have the whole team? Zorn secures another kill. Second cooldown on the on his passive, by the way. So he is really off cooldown, off rip. He is going. But now here comes the Black Dragon form. You see Subway, he's in the middle of all the members. And even dropping down the Eternal Guardian to try and zone them away. The hard card comes out too, but Chibi is going to manhandle him single-handedly as Nets tries to secure the kill. It's a lot harder than it looks, but the fear is going to put him down. Udil finds the kill as Subbot zones away three members of MV. Yeah, right now, looking at the situation here, homeboys, it looks like they just want to kite away. Oh, and, oh, oh shortcut. he shortcuts again, bringing Nets along with him, who went back to base to get his health back. I was gonna question, the hero is interesting and all, but is it first pickable? Apparently, yes. I mean, homeboys have cracked the code on this one. I, I gotta give them, this is so clean from the, like what is MV actually supposed to do at this stage of the game? Anybody who, oh, who's overextended like Subway goes down and that's mid tier one as well. Four and zero. That makes it more difficult. I mean, look at Nets. He's level 11 to Ruff's level 9. Four kills ahead of him as well. The portal comes on through with a shortcut, and now Noex Kovar, he can't get away. The crash course mini stun turns his basic attack into a ranged basic attack. These many different outs and damage types to deal with, it can be a bit rough here. I feel like it's amazing if you have a dive comp mm. where you can snowball out of control to the point where even their front nine feels squishy. Like your crits just just burst them down. Like, especially if, if the opposing side, first item, Radiant Armor or Athena Shield, oh yeah, you can snowball like crazy. Oh, that, that sounds like a good time. But speaking of a good time, Homeboy's looking to close this game out in a timely fashion. Here comes the Black Dragon form of the Shield Unity. Our guard being committed onto rough side. He's gonna have to pop the Zavin Force to try his best to zone them away. This Lord is big, but it seems like Udil is too low to commit. The Crystal starts to fall, and nobody can deal with such a chunky Lord. GG, well played. Homeboys, take game one. Hey, you know what? Homeboys, week one, they didn't do well, but week two with Chip. Oh my goodness, I'm, I'm loving this, man. I'm loving it a lot. This is disgusting, actually disgusting. I mean, it's the combination of two things. Chip, yes.